okay, okie dokie. Gym is not going to be happening today. I, um, I got to clean the house a bit. Like, not a lot, but some more intensive cleanings. Um, I was going to run some water. <laughs> the heat exchanger in the shower needs to be um, de uh, Aaron um, and I have been, when we've been taking showers, it's not draining nearly as fast. It's like cinnamon. Whatever, my nose has been all off the racks today. <laughs> it has been smelling all the weird things. Um, and it's like not like powdered cinnamon. It's like, <clears throat> whatever. <laughs> it's not powdered cinnamon, you know, like you get from the actual powder. It's the kind of the zippy stuff that you get from like a cinnamon bear. We don't have any candies like that around here. So that would be like someone put out like a candle or something. Whatever. I'm going to the store but I'm going to do a longer bike ride. Um, yeah. Because I realized if I go to the gym and then go by the store then I can't take the bottles with me. Because then I'll be grabbing gym clothes. And the bottles will be sitting in the thing. Uh, it's, it's possible. But like if I was going to the if I was going to the gym in the other place, I could take the bottles back and do my grocery shopping there. <sighs> because it was above an Albert Heine. Uh, bought. Because I've done that before, where I've 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 taken the bottles to the gym with my clothes because it was only a few and mostly plastic ones. And then I took them back there, um, kept the little thing, the bonichime, boniche, the statue called boniche. Anyways, yeah. <laughs> and so took that into the gym with me, but then when I went back down to get the groceries, I forgot. And yeah, but they didn't have something, so I went to the other Albert Hein, and I, that's when I found out years ago that they're not interchangeable between the stores. So yeah, <laughs> so I had to go back to the gym, but that, like I said, that was years ago when I was going more often. Um, so I just did like Wednesday shopping sort of thing. I got Aaron's stuff, <laughs> whatever. And tomorrow was therapy, awkward. So looks like looks like a Wednesday is going to happen. Uh, it's very very calm weather today. Um, so I think I'm going to go out there over by the ferry, but not get on the ferry. Um, No, no, that would be a bitch. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'll figure it out. But I got to let the phone charge. I got to get socks on and stuff. Um, but yeah, we're going to have like biking thoughts today. I need to unplug from WoW for a little bit. Not like weeks, but... <sighs> Yeah, see, I'm not completely against going up the bridge. <laughs> to be fair, I would have went through that area over there. But the dike for staircasing is taking a long time. Not that I want it to ever fail, but... <laughs> but yeah. I'm just going over here to the stairs and then I'm going to cut down the back way and probably zip down most of the island. But yeah, 
Like last night, the burrito, I swear to God, they spilled. <laughs> they put more in there than usual. Unless for some ungodly reason, Aaron clicked it twice. But no, that burrito was so hot. Like, with the carbonation from the tea and the beers, plus the hotness and the just solid hiccuping for 15 minutes straight. <laughs> I, I burned my throat a little bit. I feel like I have a sore throat. <laughs> and it, it's great. I mean, I wanted this. But yeah. <laughs> like, I was in the middle of doing the hiccuping. I had about five bites into the burrito. And I told Aaron to feel the back of my head. And he goes, you're sweating. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't have a shirt on also. <laughs> He's like, your shoulders are sweating, your chest is sweating. I'm like, I love it, love it so much. <laughs> but yeah. Got a little boat there. This building. <laughs> Part of the ring. If you guys ever hear me talk about the ring or it's Germans or anything, at least Amsterdam, a couple other cities, German ones, have highways that go around the city center. <laughs> and they're called the, the ring road. Uh, I know that London has them, and maybe some metropolitan areas in the States have them. Uh, but, like, the actual downtown core of Portland is surrounded by I-405 and I-5. Uh, so, kind of. But if you want to skirt the whole city of Portland, you take 205. And which will go way out to the side, way out east. <laughs> and skirt a lot of the hang-ups and backups that come from actual like downtown traffic. But like I-5 splits off to the right near the south waterfront and it merges on with 84 which cuts out east and then 405 goes west goes clockwise and uh, highway 26 which goes out to the coast splits off from there so and then back in like north portland they merge back together or near North Portland. <laughs> but here, the ring is, well, just around Amsterdam. There's no major highway that goes through the central area. In fact, <laughs> you could say by going underneath that bridge, I live inside the ring. I would think I live on the ring, but whatever. That was a solid eight kilometers <laughs> by the time I got to Albert Hein, and I didn't stop because the three lights I would have needed to go to, or go that needed to stop at, were green. So, <laughs> fun, yeah. Like, there was about one going up the bridge, but, yeah, see? The only time my, yeah, see, right there, my speed dropped as I was going down the stairs, but other than that, this has a maximum of 23, but you can see right there, the tip of my thumb, that's about, that's just me going straight at a casual six or seven on the gears. So yeah. Yeah. And then I turned a couple times and yeah. 
but the heart rate, that's what I was looking for. I was looking for like, well, it says there's VO2 max, and that's, I don't like the fact that I got into VO2 max, but it's good.